Hey, what's up, YouTube? This is Mr. Cupano with my actual 5 off 25 scenario that I did today. Um, I suppose it had been two scenarios because I would end up spending out of pocket no more than $15, $16 for the items that I was going to get. Um, both scenarios included the Unstoppables, included that, included that, included the play tax, as well as some additional items. So I went to the first Dollar General, which is about four minutes up the road from me. This is the first scenario that I did. Um, the total, because I also had um, two off of the kit, which is I scanned that, and the two dollar, well, it was the, the Duster starter kit, which is this 450, and then I had a two dollars off, which would have made it 250. So, I forgot exactly what my subtotal was when, I think it was like 30 something, I think it was like 30 dollars or some change or something like that, I believe. So, I said, well, let me put my phone number in and see what come off. Because I decided last minute to get the um, Duster starter kit. Because yesterday I was looking for a different starter kit. So when I went, that was the last one they had. So I'm like, let me put in the buggy. Let me see what my total is going to be. I think it was like 30 something. So I said, well, let me put in my digitals. Everything, well, not everything, but the digitals came off. And then she was like, well, your sub, your total is, um, I think it was like 19 something. I'm like, no, that's not what my subtotal, my total is supposed to be. And she was like, well, you know, all your digitals came off. I say, no, what I calculated, even with the, my total is supposed to have been a little bit lower than this. If not, um, a little bit lower than this. So it was higher. I'm like, something is not coming off. I say, remove the duster off and let me see what it was. So she was like, well, now your total is 13.25. I'm like, some coupons, a coupon or some coupons is not coming off. So you could go to the, the pen pad and you can look to see which coupons came off. So it looked like she was getting a little frustrated or whatever. So I was like, I don't care. You know, at the end of the day, this is my money. I work hard for, I'm trying to do coupon to do help other people out. I didn't tell her that, but I said that to myself. I said, well, I'm going to figure it out. So I said, well, it's $5. I still say 14, almost $15, but I suppose I had saved $18 off of this um, trip. So what ended up basically happening, um, this is my total. I suppose that I had eight dollars before taxes. This is what my total was. Uh -oh. right. Had to hide the store location. So this is what my total was after all coupons came on. So I was like, I didn't have time to, you know, argue. I wanted to, she voided, I had her void out the second transaction because that one was ridiculous. I, I seemed like nothing came off. That total was like 19 and some change. And I'm like, something is not coming off. Because I was like, let me, maybe I was like, you know, if something went good with the second one, I would just accepted it and moved on. But the second one, was worse than the first one. I'm like, I didn't come in the store to spend over 20 something to $30 on items where my subtotal is supposed to only been for both trips, which is a little bit more than this, I'm supposed to have been to about 12 to $15 for everything. There's no way in hell I'm gonna spend $30. So I was like, just go ahead and void out the second transaction. So I say, well, the five off, I, thought the five off 25 didn't come off. So she was like, well, you know, you have to spend $5 in order for the five off 25 to come off. And I'm like, well, my subtotal was more than 25. If anything, the five off 25 should have came off first. 
there is no other Dollar General discounts that I'm getting. The only other discounts that I was getting was um, the Dollar General discounts, which is, I believe, I think those are the manufacturer discounts. Let me. No, it was the. Um, I think everything, I think, I believe everything was manufactured discounts, if I'm not mistaken, which was the five off of the two unstoppable, four off of the Febreze one, five off of the Febreze one, four off of the Febreze unstoppable. So... I got in the car, I was like, well, let me go to another Dollar General, which was about five minutes up the road. <laughs> Man, that was another problem because I got the same items plus a little bit more, but it's still the, basically the price would have offset. So my total still should have came out to be the same. So she was like, well, your subtotal it's $20 even. I'm like, wait, that's wrong. So I was like, I paid for it. So then, cause at this point I was fed up with Dollar General. I'm like, let me go ahead and pay for it. I didn't want to hold up the line. So I went to the car, I looked and only because I, okay, this time I presented the paper five off 25 because I'm like, let me present the five paper five off 25 to see if that's what the problem is. Because sometimes if I have a paper, I would use the paper, then put in my phone number, or I would just do all digitals. So I gave her the, the five off um, five paper coupon. So she gave my new subtotal. I said, well, I have digitals. I put my phone number in, dropped it to 20. I'm like, something's not coming off. So it was a little line or whatever. That's why I like to go kind of almost 30 minutes or so before they close, because if I have any problems, I could be right there and get it fixed out. So I paid for it or whatever. And then I went to the car. Only two coupons came off, which is supposed to have been one, two, three, four, four or five coupons supposed to have it came off. Only two, which was the five off 25 came off. And then the, um, believe it was the Playtex. So th these razors right here, is seven dollars. I'm not gonna use them. I got them for um, donation or whatever. But these razors by itself is seven dollars. They had a three off coupon for that one. That didn't come off. Then the four, um, the four or five for the Febreze didn't come off. And then the two off of the twelve didn't come off. And there was something else that came off. So that didn't come off. So I was like, just, I went back and she was gonna try to figure out the coupon. I'm like, nah, I don't have time to wait. Just go ahead and, you know, refund me back the money or whatever. I said, I'm gonna hold up your mind. Seemed like she was much nicer than the first one. But this is the actual scenario I did at the first store. So each of these um, Febreze ones are $5 each. That was you to break up the five off 25 discount. I figured that's what didn't come off, but it did come off. What did not come off, which is the five off of the two for Breeze. And then, okay, so the 75 cents off of the Playtex came off. And as you look at the Febreze Unstoppable, um, that didn't come off. And then I went to, when I went to the other Dollar General, I grabbed two of these to see if that's the problem. It wasn't that. It still didn't come off. So my total savings for this trip was $14.75, which is, I think is still good. But, you know, I'm, I'm still pissed off about them $5 that didn't come off. So that was my subtotal. So again, you know, if anybody figure out what's going on, why, you know, whatever's not coming off, Please let me know. If you have not subscribed, please subscribe and please share my video. Thank you for watching.